tradition and innovation. In their sound, we encounter technical assuredness bolstered by elegant lyricism and joyful dynamism. It is music forged from a unique artistic vision that rests upon a legacy seven generation deep and includes the revered father and grandfather, Ustad Amjad Ali Khan and Ustad Hafiz Ali Khan. Karshkali is widely regarded as a pioneer of global fusion and electronica, as his music has inspired and defined the worldwide club phenomenon known as Asian Massive or Asian Underground. Today, Karsh's music has traveled far past the underground club scene as a world-class tabla player, drummer, producer, composer, songwriter, and remixer. The album is exclusively releasing today on GeoSavan Worldwide. I would like to thank our partners, The Park, for being such a warm and generous host, Johnny Walker for their immense support and collaboration, and Showhouse for their association. I would now like to request Aman Ali Bangash, Ayan Ali Bangash, Karsh Kale, and Karan Johar to please come on stage. I would also request noted screenwriter and lyricist Niranjar Ayangar to moderate the session. Hi, good evening. Good evening, everybody. Yes, uh, I've been posted. Karan. Uh, you've known Aman and Ayan for many, many years now, and uh, you know you've been watching their musical journey as well. And uh, so, what do you think of their uh, growth as artists? Uh, actually, I do know Aman and Ayan for about 15 to 20 years. I think uh, it dates back to the time that we used to stay in the same hotel in New York. And I, um, we shot two films extensively in New York, and Aman and Ayan were like part of that that crew because they would come on tour and we would meet there often through Kalhona Ho and Kabi Alvida Nakena. Um, and I remember at that time, more than searching for music, they were looking for wives. Um, uh, but uh, uh, Aman is still looking. He was. Uh, <laughs> Ayan did very well. We have his beautiful wife in the audience. Uh, but that was the time that we used to talk more about that than music. Um, but then I was very proud and extremely uh, excited to see their musical journey unravel over the years. And I love the way they've gone from strength to strength. And it is not easy uh, to live with and under the shadow of, a, of an international legend, their father. And yet they kind of always dealt with that with, with pride and dignity and always with a lot of humility. And that is also in their music for everyone to see. There's a lot of humility and honesty in their music. And I love the fact that they've collaborated with Karsh. And I think it's an interesting step in a totally new direction for them. And I really look forward to myself as a filmmaker collaborating. Music is a large part of what I do as a filmmaker. And spe specifically, I've grown up on Indian music, Indian film music. Um, not as much classical as I would have liked to, but that was your big influence in my life that took me there. And I love the fact that you're in full-on Sufi mode today, Niranjan. Uh, um, and uh, I, yeah, Niranjan sings, by the way. Um, he's been, ever since I've known Aman and Ayan, Niranjan's been singing. Uh, uh, so I, I think it's an, really an exceptional platform today. I feel very humbled and honored to be here today. And I really wish Aman and Ayan all the best. And I also wish you find your beautiful wife soon. <laughs>